I'm James Crouch here with Alliance Tire and today we're going to be talking about soil compaction and what you can do to minimize it. Soil compaction is defined as anything that reduces the porosity of the soil and reduces the ability for water and air to reach the root systems of your crop. You're starting to see a lot more about it at trade shows, you're reading more about it in papers. There are a lot of university studies being done right now to, to figure out soil compaction and what we can do. It's hard to pin how much damage soil compaction actually has to a crop, but what we do know for sure is that compaction will reduce your yield. So anything you can do to reduce your compaction will increase your yield. As far as the equipment goes and the tires go, the simplest thing you can do is check your air pressure. Uh, the correctly inflated tire will minimize your compaction, whether that's a standard radial or even a bias, it will minimize your compaction. There are a few additional steps you can do to further minimize your compaction. If you look at IF and VF technology tires, they reduce your pressure uh, while carrying the load. So for example, a four wheel drive tractor, instead of needing 12 PSI or 14 PSI in the tire, you may only need eight with an IF or a VF tire. What that does is it gives you a much longer footprint. So you have this 50,000 pound machine that now you're spreading over the largest area possible. Uh, think about it like a snowshoe. You wear a snowshoe in the snow to stay up on top, gives you nice flotation to keep from punching down into the, into the snow. You would never wear a boot to expect to walk on top of the snow. You wear a snowshoe. It's the exact same thing. Spread your weight over the largest area possible. So we get asked a lot on how, how to know how much pressure you're actually putting on the soil. A good rule of thumb is that in a standard row crop front wheel assist tire, it's normally about equivalent to what the air pressure is inside the tire. So if you're running 25 PSI inside the tire, you're probably a little higher than 25 PSI on the ground. The, the easiest tip I can give for this is that with no investment at all, you can reduce your compaction. Simply know the weight of your machine and set your air pressures correctly. That will minimize your compaction with no investment at all.